if you don't want to miss out any of our uploads all you have to do is just turn on the notification bell and anytime we upload a new video you're going to receive an alert on your phone from youtube assalamu alaikum Shaitan sets his, his throne on water. You know that hadith, right? And he basically gives incentives to his helpers from the jinni. Whoever does the best job today in misguiding Muslims, I will place the crown with my own hands on your head. Disperse. Then the jinn would disperse to do their mischief. The shaitan, he sits with his shayateen, they're giving him reports. So one shaitan says, I made this man commit zina. And shaitan, he just hears him. This is Bukhari and Muslim, so it's a sound hadith. And he, the shaitan, another shaitan comes and says, I made this man steal. I made this guy do this. I made this guy do that. I made this woman do this. I made this woman make, you know, remove her hijab. I made... So they keep on you know, submitting their reports to him. And then one shaitan, one guy comes and say, I made one man separate from his wife. And he says, you're the man. Enter, enter, enter. Come, come, enter, enter. And then he will bring him and says, Six, sit next to me. You're my beloved one. This jinni will stand up and say, today I was able to separate a husband and a wife. You know what shaitan will say? Ni'ma ant. Anta ant. You are my man. Come out. And crowns him. Hadith Sahih Muslim, Hadith Jabir. Reflect upon this. Smoking weed is haram. Killing is haram. Adultery is haram. Name any sin you want. Divorce is not haram. Divorce is not haram. Why is he so excited? He's so happy about divorce. Why? Your enemy always likes to do what? Divide and conquer. Now he is able to divide the first unit in the community. Because look at your community. The community is made of what? Units. Imagine a wall, bricks. The family is the first brick in the community. The first unit. Becomes then easy to divide the community, divide a congregation. He has long-term plans. The one who separates between a husband and a wife, he is most beloved to shaitan. Be careful. Don't let the shaitan trick you. Iblis throne. So people have been talking about Iblis. Where is he? His throne. The Prophet has reported, you know, in a very sound hadith, which is in Muslim, reported by Jabir, that Arsh uh, al-Shaytan, Arsh al-Iblis, al al ma Arsh al-Iblis, al al ma The throne of Iblis, the throne of Shaytan, this is the master of Shaytan. The master of Shaytan. His throne is on water. Where? What water? What ocean? Allahu Ta'ala A'lam. But there are certain indications that could maybe tell us where his throne could be. There's another hadith where it says, Innahu, this is also in, in Muslim, Innahu, Inda Barzakh il Ma. Inda Barzakh il Ma. What's a Barzakh? A Barzakh, it's like a partition. You know, when you have the sweet water and the salty water, you know. Whereby the sweet water does not merge with the salty water. That's a barzakh. That's a partition. In this hadith, he says he is on this barzakh. His, ash, his throne is on this barzakh. His throne is on this barzakh, which is again somewhere in, 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 a, in an ocean. But now, I want to bring something up here. Have you heard of the uh, Triangle of Bermuda. What happens there? I mean, something that nobody could still explain up till today. Flight 19. Have you heard of Flight 19? That disappeared. 
all these flights and ships that, that disappeared. The South Tiger 1948, you know, um, they got the black box. They hear the guy saying, I, uh, I see something, I see something, I don't know what it is. And nobody could explain, I see something, I don't know what it is. And then they said, okay, we're sending help. It's been recorded. It, you can play it. it. You can find it on the internet. Uh, we're sending help. We're sending help. He said, okay. And then the guy comes back and he says, no, I'm, I cannot control the plane. I cannot control the plane. I don't know what's this. I don't know what it is. And then he goes back again and he says, don't send nobody. Don't send no one. And nobody can help. Not send no one. And then he just, after some time, disappeared. It's not only one flight, but there's so many flights that disappeared and ships that disappeared off of this, this Bermuda. So some said, that, does that mean that maybe the throne of shaitan is there? Allahu ta'ala a'lam, but it could be.